Hi everyone, in this video we're looking at apl applications of geometric sequences. So I've just got a word problem here that we can go through. Um, so just reading through it, the production on a wheat farm is decreasing by 8% each year. So that means that our R value would be 0 0.92 uh, because there will be um, 0 0.08 um, losing each year. Um, in year one, the production was 660 tonnes, so that means that our first term is 660. And the question is asking us to calculate the production in, t in year four, so that's a term problem. And so we're looking for T4, and that's going to be 660 times 0 0.92 to the power of n minus 1, so that's to the power of 3. So we put that into a calculator. And there's our answer, 513.93 tonnes. Okay, so for part B, it's asking us to calculate the total production for years 1 to 10. So that's asking us to sum for the first 10 years. Um, and we may just want to quickly go back and check our sum formula. So using this formula here. Um, so that means that we um, want A, which is the first term, times R to the power of N, which is 10, minus 1, all over R, which is 0 0.92, minus 1. Now this is that case that we're talking about when we've got an R of less than um, 1, and so we actually want to write these around the other way. So we'll just write it as 1 minus 0 0.92 the power of 10 um, all over 1 minus 0 0.92. Okay, so let's put that into our calculator. 660 times 1 minus 0.92 to the power of 10. And that's divided by um, 1 minus 0 0.09, so that'll be 0 0.08. And then we get 4 1,666 tonnes, so 4666.30 tonnes to GDP. Okay, so uh, once you've interpreted what each uh, constant is, it's pretty easy doing um, these application problems. And so there's a few application problems we'll practice just there. Thank you.